What is up everyone, this is Mo Gaming here, and today I'm going to show you how to fix the PlayStation 5 IPv6 network connection error that you may be getting in 2022. So let's get right into this. So this IPv6 network connection error that you get is something weird where you're trying to like log in to your router or, or your internet connection, I should say, and you basically you go to settings, you go to network, over here you're trying to like sign in, you're testing the internet connection and it's just not working, and... You're basically like, what is happening? So there's a couple of things that you can do to essentially fix this error. So the first thing you want to do is you want to go to your settings, right? And in your settings, you want to go to the, uh, actually, before even moving on, you want to just kind of stay in this scene. And then what you want to do is the first thing is you find your router if possible, right? Uh, if not, you can kind of like skip into the video later to how to fix it. But if you can have your router, right, you want to essentially unplug and plug your router back in after 10 to 15 seconds. The second thing you want to do with your router is you want to actually press. There's usually a button that you can either press or push in with a pin uh, resetting your router. This will kind of bring your router back to a factory default settings, which in a lot of times will end up fixing and resolving this issue for you. So you want to actually do that to basically do this for you. A lot of times this error happens because of that, that your router has either updated on its own or kind of formatted or all of that weird stuff happens ends up fixing or causing these issues to occur because of port forwarding or some network issues or whatever uh, a lot of times your router isn't up to date either which again you can do it yourself there's a way to go to your router setting and i can't give you a blanket statement on how to do it because it's different for every single router. A lot of folks ask me, how do I do it? I can't really tell you. I have a Netgear router. There's an app for Netgear. You can actually do it from a browser as well. Every single one is different. So it's hard for me to kind of say exactly do X, Y, or Z because it's not that simple, right? So um, overall, regardless, that, that's essentially how you, uh, that's one of the things that you should definitely do. The next thing is you can kind of, once you have it connected, you can play around in the connection itself you can change the wi-fi frequency band uh, if that doesn't help connect it you can go into the settings itself and you can the other thing you can do is you can make your dns manual and change it to whatever dns works better in your region so i have google's right now so it's 8.8.8.8 .8 and secondary is 8.8.4.4 so doing this a lot of times fixes a lot of these weird issues that you may possibly be having on your settings and then essentially doing this press ok and then you're kind of good to go from there uh, so yeah, like I said, you trying these different methods out should hopefully fix this IPv6 issue that you're having. It did for me, uh, and then you should be good to go. So yeah, that's basically it. If you guys overall liked the video, please smash that like button. If you guys are new to the channel, make sure to subscribe and click that notification bell. And that moment, yeah.